All right, welcome back to some more trivia. We have guessed that team based on some stats. <laughs> Throw up CJ Stroud, I dare you. I swear to God. <laughs> this <laughs> microphone's through you. the TV. <laughs> so last time we did this, you guys dominated it. Went 5-0, and oh, clean sweep. I made them a little bit harder. Couldn't even touch my ass hands with this one. So, you guys will be working sweet. together. Tony's like, I'm not going to entertain that. I don't even that. know what you said. I just heard ass hairs at You'd the just end be pulling out the most random phrases. Just the yeah. <laughs> crazy analogies. It's what you got to do. All right. Three minutes. Y'all know the rules. Together? Together. One bite. As Everybody knows the rules. Actually. Yeah. Don't touch me. Yeah. You're sick. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, <you're laughs> I feel it, like, coming <laughs> on <laughs> as we're doing these. <laughs> you're so fried. I'm flued up. <laughs> you might as well be in the fucking frying pan right now. First team. <laughs> three, <laughs> two, one. Oh, Burn. I know who this is. Burn on both sides. <laughs> uh, CJ All right, hold up. So I think the biggest clue here might be the 14 and 12 receiving touchdowns. Um, feels a little bit – we don't have a time frame. It's kind of tough. Only 40 three. touchdowns is like you got to cook. Get it, J-Mo. Is there any – Their running back is fucking dog water. Dude. Is there a Buccaneers, Brady, Mike Evans, Godwin action right here? Uh, 2019, 20? No. To be honest, this is almost they both hit a thousand. Feeling like Rodgers' second MVP, the twenty twenty two one. Ooh, this could be Jordy Randall Cobb. Oh, this could be Jordy Randall Cobb, and then I don't Aaron know who the Jones running back is. is. That feels like a the four rushing touchdowns is like where Rodgers gets at all the time. Back then, that feels like a Jordy stat line I've seen twelve fifty seven. This, right, this, this feels like in. the pack, the pack gods. You're locking the Packers. Yeah. This is the 2017 Green Bay Packers. Duh. We got Rodgers. Don't touch me. Ty Montgomery as their leading rusher. <laughs> oh, I'm this was Devontae. <laughs> yeah, oh, Devontae. It wasn't Elf. Cobb. Okay. I think astray, I would have said 2014 Packers. Me too. Who the fuck's that running back? Ty Montgomery. Oh, yeah, wow. he's a fucking bot. Yeah. yeah, this was the last year of Eddie Lacy, but Montgomery ended up getting like seven more carries or something. 20? Sad. Sad way to go out. Yeah. The king. <laughs> the, <laughs> the, king. <laughs> the king is dead. Should have buried him in the tomb. <laughs> 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 All right. <laughs> one to know to start it. Next team. Three, two, one. Oh, my ass. Watch this be like Trevor Lawrence last season. We got, we got 2,000 yards from the running back. Two trash-ass receivers. This is this a Todd Gurley year? Like, golf wasn't like that until – Nah, you might, you might, we might be on here. Tavon Austin, Sammy Watkins, Robert Woods here. Hey, Don, Cooper Cup. <sighs> I don't know Tailand. if I want to bite off on that bat yet. Well, Woods and Cup were they kept producing at the same level and just switching touchdown numbers. T- to be honest, I feel like Todd might have had more touchdowns. Maybe fifteen. I think that's right. No, no, I, th- I think one of the years he had like twenty, maybe one he had less. But I, I remember we were always overwhelmed by how many, underwhelmed by how many rushing yards he had. Will Scott 2K. Could this be like some 700 receiving yards? Like, this is barely 2K. Josh Jacobs? No. Uh, his was 2,053 yards. I feel like that's barely over. All right. Well, who are the, who are the other options here? Maybe like uh, LaShawn McCoy or Le'Veon Bell? Yeah. Think about LaShawn in, in Philly. Maybe, yeah, I mean, Big Ben ain't throwing 20 and 12. Yeah. But like, yeah, this would also be like ABs. Yeah, not Bell. I think LaShawn McCoy's big year, he had like 17 rushing touchdowns too. All right. I, f- I feel it's number one. But did Jared Goff really just go Talk twenty about, and twelve? It's, it's a, he fucking stunk there, dude. He, he still was. Thinks he th- will he never be better than Kyler. One Sorry. minute, dude. Goff put up numbers as a Ram. No, yeah, he but was I think it was it. the following year. Like if this was 2017, 2018, they got to the Super Bowl. Well, okay, so Gurley came in as a rookie 2016, had the slump 2017. No. Or no, was it one year off? Yeah, we just did year. it, and 17 was a good year. 17, 18 were the good years. I don't know. That doesn't help at all, but. Nah, it does. I, I, I think Sammy I'm too Watkins, Tavon Austin and close-minded on the Rams, but I don't have much else. No, block 30 seconds. In. Rams. I, I'm I'm good with the Rams, yeah. I just feel face. like Goff usually put up better numbers than that. He's going to be like 2003 Dante Culpepper. It's the Eagles, huh? Locking in the Rams? Yeah. yeah. This is not the Rams. Yeah, Fuck. Whatever. Unfortunately, this is actually the 2011 Baltimore Ravens. Okay. Mm. That's bullshit. Joe Flacco, Ray Rice in his 2,000-yard season. Never, and Quan yeah, Bolden ever and Torrey Smith. To be Ray honest, Rice. I wasn't getting there. I tried to block him out of my memory. Next team in three, two, one. Right. 5,000 passing yards. Wow. All right, there's only so many of those. All right, this screams fucking your boy, Jay Herbo. Mm. Running back 500, 500. Well, Keenan never had 16 touchdowns, though, did he? Yeah, no, probably not. I'm thinking this might be Brady. Brady? This could be 
I'm like, those do look like Evans, Evans and Godwin stat lines. Lenny, Lenny with five and five. That could make sense. All right, well, let's mm. let's think. He said this would be harder. I was thinking Brady Patriots. No, nope, this is Stafford with Calvin. Ooh. He said this would be harder. I don't Calvin. think he would okay. just go bust. That, that also looks like a Reggie Bush stat line too. There's only been like what eight QBs. Five K. He's, I think he's done it twice. Maybe he did it once. And that could be Golden Tate down there. That I mean, that also. Is Calvin's big touchdown no, year, 2011 or whatever. No, because he had, he had 1600 yards in his big touchdown year, or 1400. It was one of the two. I don't remember him ever being at 12 to 16 yards. I don't remember him. Let's seeing think, him at 12. Let's think of other 5,000 yard Stafford, passers. Jameis, not Jameis. His was 30 picks. <laughs> <laughs> big Ben. Yeah. Is this a Drew Brees year? Okay, mm. let's let's think about that, that could then. Be like MT. But that uh, Drew Brees' big years were back in the day, no? Weren't they like 13? Oh, wait, is, is that like Jimmy? Jimmy is that Jimmy? <sighs> Jimmy had 1,300 yards a big year. This might be Drew Brees, like 2011. Dude, Jimmy Graham definitely had a 16 touchdown season. Oh, we so cooked. Still Reggie Bush. <laughs> <laughs> this feels 52 more rushing Saints. yards? Yeah. But let's, let's, Stafford let's try to think of the touchdown numbers, though. When day. Brees threw for 5,000, did he only throw 39 touchdowns? Only? Yeah. I mean, it's still only a lot. Is One minute it is, I guess. But okay. Also, fifty-two rush yards kind of gives it away for me. Stafford gets fucking mobile. Okay. One more, one more throw out here. What about Peyton Manning? And those numbers look a little bit like Demarius Thomas numbers too. He had some monster seasons. To be honest, I think they were bigger yards yeah. wise. Yeah, they might have been. Did no Sean Moreno go off too? Also, I think Peyton might have only had like when he hit five thousand. I think it was a record. I don't know if he did it again. Mm. If that makes sense. 25 seconds. I feel good about just hoping it was a Saints here. I feel good about Breeze and Jim. Yeah. yeah. 39 and 12. I don't know if Payne never got three runner. I also, I feel like low-key Stafford was probably more reckless <coughs> than that ratio. Th- yeah. 39 and, and 12 is efficient. All right. Yeah, Saints. The New Orleans Saints. Let's just take one moment. Yes. Real quick Sir. and recognize the game of Jimmy Graham. His big year in 2013. 16 touchdowns, 1,200 Sproles? yards. No. no, that's uh, Pierre Thomas. Yes. Mm, never. Yeah. I've actually good, never good pass heard catcher. of that person. Very good pass catcher. All right, two and one. Dub. Two more teams to go. That was like the perfect difficulty. Yeah. We should, we should just know Jimmy Graham's 2013. We should just keep right doing that same one over yeah. and over. Different players on that team. I would have been so disappointed if we just stuck with the Bucks early on. <laughs> yeah, lock it in. <laughs> so fucking cheese. Next team. Here we go. 40 touchdowns. There's there's nothing significant on this fucking board. Is this Cole Pepper? Chill. We got some end arounds. AB Debo? twenty rushing yards. <laughs> Listen, there's one I should probably take rushing yards off of the receiver <laughs> one. I thought I thought I'd be able to find receivers with more rushing yards. Like they yeah, really but I feel just like don't be still I mean, it keeps it symmetrical. Enough. Yeah. So that means that's the only reason I have it, JMO. <laughs> you could just forty play. passing touchdowns is a pretty lofty number. Yeah, that's also another like tough mark. Only a few guys hit. What? 40 passing. All right, Jim, I think that's our biggest 40. clue there. Still in 40 passing touchdowns. Human computer, what is Ooh, that? Ooh, is this, is this Russ? 2020, and that's DK in his big year? Lockett would have been bigger, Lock, right? I feel like Lockett's been Stop. like 950 or above for like yeah. seven straight years. Lockett only two yugs, too, that year. It was definitely can't be the three touchdowns. That feels like DK's. No, it's not. It's not Russ. Yeah, I feel, I feel like those numbers are a little inflated for Russ. Um... Dude. Also, wait, hold on. 16 interceptions is a lot. Loki, I'm thinking Culpepper, but that's like... <sighs> Would Tony really do that, though? I don't know. 40s. Tony even don't know what teams he was on. This isn't like just Mahomes in 2022, is it? That's Kelsey. Now he had more touchdowns at seven. And he definitely didn't have 20 rushing yards. They're not handing the rock off to Kelsey like that. That's fair. All right, let's think of QBs. Oh. Oh. What about... This um, is... One minute. Uh, is this not Puka and the Rams now? No. no. He had 1,400 40 yards. and 16 feels like Stafford with the Rams. But Kyron way higher. Yeah. Kyron no, no, no. But like the 2021 year, but a couple uh, of them had 1,900. Yeah, no. This or Kurt Warner? Is this a... <sighs> I couldn't help you there. Is this Kurt Warner? No, he had 41 touchdowns. I'm looking at thinking he went back to Big Ben. 273 for rushing yards is like the Rodgers, Mahomes tier like of like athleticism. Okay, wait. What about... No, that's sense we need more time i was gonna say yeah. 20 seconds it's not a joe burrow stat line let's keep Old cooking Steelers. all right let's go through all the fucking team 10 seconds oh mcnab let's throw out a final answer uh wait wait, wait. carson palmer's five, big year four 
three. Oh, they had David Johnson. Two. Dallas Cowboys. What the fuck? No, unfortunately, you guys didn't mention this team. It is the 2014 Indianapolis Colts. I thought uh, you were. You guys luck. felt a little bit on track with the, like the luck with his high interceptions mm. and, the, and the mobility of it. But T.Y. Hill got into rounds. Yeah, it couldn't quite go right, there. Right, this was T.Y.'s right. big year. Yeah. Fucking shit, Jameson. Trent, Trent Richardson and Reggie Wayne. That's Reggie. Damn, he's still doing it at that point? Uh, yeah, this was his last year of his career. Yeah, not really That's doing it. a strong it. final year, to be honest. I mean, Too bad he was like five yards short of Marvin forever living his shadow. All right. We Martin got two correct. We have two incorrect. Right. For the game. This is for the game. This is for respect. I'm a little. That, that was also a good difficulty. We just suck. The last one. Mm, I think it's a good mix. All right, I think well, it's a good mix. I think so it's a good level of difficulty. I think this is. You done great. Yeah. Your team. What's your like a seven year? The span. Ravens though. That one was hard. Your team is, bang. Oh god. Your mother. Damn. Negative right. nine rushing <laughs> yards. What a guy. We got what some huge. Guy. Okay, wait, hold up though. Brother ran backwards for us. 112 catches, 1600 yards, four touchdowns. Who the fuck? That's got to be some like fucking. Who doing that with 1400 slot rushing receiver? Yards. This quarterback is the biggest letdown of all time. Is this ass? There's no way that's C.J. Stroud. No, I was gonna say maybe like Larry Fitz and David Johnstein. Fifteen. He's a piece of shit quarter or like Andre Larry Johnson. Larry Fitz and. David Johnson. Like, if it's not a 1500. Yo. Like David Carr, Arian Foster, Andre Johnson. You might have did something. Uh, wait, what'd you say for the quarterback? David Carr. It's probably Matt Shaw. Edit, that, edit that out, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, that, that, that could make sense. Brandon Whedon, whatever the fuck. That feels like Foster. I mean, that could be like rookie DeAndre Bro, Hopkins. Ain't no way. 350 carries. SM. No, no, no. Andre Johnson was putting up numbers like this. Like, he led the league in receptions yeah. twice. And ain't what? no way he only put up four yugs. Dude, he, he was like one of the, he, he had years he like, like that. Julio he was like Julio. Yeah, exactly. Maybe I, I actually Julio. think you fucking nailed that, dude. I 350 think carries? Foster was getting them like that, yeah. Who would be the second receiver during then? Maybe it's D-Hop's rookie year. D-Hop's sophomore. But then again, <sighs> Foster. What, what year did D-Hop come in? 12? 13. 13? Okay. Well, yeah. So, Foster went crazy 2010, 2010, 11. I don't know if he was getting 350 by the time 2013 came around. Could this be like Jamal Charles, Dwayne Bow? No, uh, Dwayne, I feel like, had the Yuds. It was just once. This Wes Welker? Dude, see, that's Ain't what I was no, thinking, like a slot wide receiver, but. Ain't no fucking running back. 350 on the carries is so much. And One minute. 15 rushing touchdowns. AJ Brown ever cracked the 1500 mark? Smith did better, right? What about Steve Smith? He had a hundred. You're saying with Titans. Ooh. What about Steve Smith? Oh, uh, Smith, Smith. Steve Smith was good. He it was like triple crown. I don't know who on the Panthers have a negative nine rushing yards. I mean, like Kerry was Collins. Him, Kerry Collins, Jake Delhomme, like any of those fuckers. Did any of them have a four K? Yeah, is this like a D-Lo Steve Smith? It could. That's what I was thinking, Dan. I think it would have been more split. Not sixteen hundred and three. Oh, that carries. sucks ass. Yeah. I feel like who's our other one? The Saint or the Texans? Also, Mushin was putting up fucking numbs. But it could just be like one year that just kind of threaded yeah. the needle on there. Like Jake Delhomme, I feel like has a four thousand yard season. Seconds. Probably gonna need some final answers so here. You know, I, I I really I know Steve had the triple crown. I'm kind of trusting Steve to have more touchdowns. Yeah, you definitely. Final did. answers: three Texans, two. I'm I'm cool with that. That feels one. like an Andre Johnson line. Texans. This is for the game. The 2012 Let's Houston go. Texans. Great pull. Great fucking Big pool. years from Andre Johnson and <laughs> Arian Foster. Uh, then you have Owen Daniels at tight end mm. as their second option. And Matt Schaub. Kind of Matt Schaub's big-ish year, I guess. This might be my favorite game. <laughs> yeah. This is the great I actually really like You this thrive game. here. Matty, you need to unhitch it. Just let it go. Either so way, Ar- Arian Foster, Andre Johnson, one of the best receiver running back yeah, combos in, is in a season. a strong duo. All for yeah. nothing. <laughs> Three and a combined. What did they go? Six. Fucking like six and ten. Yeah, yeah. Bro. They had a combined seventeen hundred <laughs> yards and six tuds. <laughs> All right, they had they had to sacrifice like their bodies. Three hundred yards. <laughs> I was on receiving. That shop just smiling. <laughs> Check us out on YouTube for the full length version. <laughs> like, They're all so pissed, Matt Shop. It's like, thanks for doing the work for me, guys. <laughs> Matt Shop got an A on the project. Matt Shop's like, I'm here to get sacked. Thanks. What the? This is the coolest fools. thing I've ever seen. This all is right. the coolest oh, thing ever. I totally forgot to change the title of this. All right, we're not doing any type of quarterback trivia. This is yeah, this is head same. coaches. I was about to say that that no, top look hat. Young. This is head coaches. My bad for not having the title ready, but um. What I have here is every single head coach who has at least 
50 more wins in their career than losses. Mm. Right. Ever? Nailed Ever. In. in their Go career. Paterno. All right. Tom Landry. Who was the, do you don't. remember the other day? One, two, three, four. Five, Might have been the millionaire one for me. Someone was like overrated as fuck. Like we were both like, it never would have said that. Guy. Yeah. No, I remember. I don't know. Who I think is. I know who it is. Too. Anyways, you don't this help. is. Uh, it's just a team game? No, no, no this is not a team game. Why the fuck I was asking before the game started. There's 23 answers. I think maybe like first to six. Sure. We'll see how Such it goes. A, I hate that we do that. Like, I don't know. I, I'm always panic as a host. I'm like, right. I don't know. Whatever. Just, someone just win. All right, Gut, you feel confident? Why don't you start yeah, it off? We'll go Billy, Billy Belichick. How it's done. <sighs> Fuck. Bill Belichick. Not where I thought he was going to be. Yeah. Dub. All right. Let's go Andy Reid. You're a bitch for that. Pump pass kick. Andy Reid is the correct answer. Oh, uh, yeah. Silhouette ain't doing it. 50 more wins. We need to get college coaches on here. <sighs> Urban Meyer needs to be on this list. I'd be cooked. Uh, it feels like it didn't happen. No. Uh, let's go with Tony Dungy. Tony Dungy is the correct answer. Vincent Lombardi. Dude, you see the guy in the third row all the way to the right? Yeah. Does that look like Trump? <laughs> <laughs> Not really. With the, ha- you know, with, the, with the MAGA hat? Summer saying. I mean, he was, I, well, he coached in the 80s, right? Yeah. Vincent Lombardi is the right answer. <laughs> Brother. Who did you say, Vince? Brother, you know. All right. Don Shula. Fuck. Don Shula. The Don. The number one answer on the board. What a fucking G. Oh, is this in order? Yeah, so he has the most wins. Someone's still top of Bill. Over Don. What about uh, John Madden? John Madden, the cover boy himself. There he is. How about John Harbaugh? I feel like I see him. I know. Bottom left. Yeah. Johnny Harbaugh? That's correct. Yeah, mm. yeah there he is. There's That's that good. cheese. It's a good pick. Yeah, looking All right. great. All right, 500. Mike Tomlin? Fuck. I keep thinking that, like, it didn't separate enough over the years. Yeah, but, I mean... I use the goat. Yeah, yeah a, I don't know. I'm like, a moron. Mike Tomlin, one of the more underrated goats, in my opinion. That's mm. your boy? That's my boy. Everybody else looks like they're 40s. Facts. 50's a lot. Ryan Billick. About it. That's, I think, who was the millionaire question. No, I don't know. That was... Ryan Billick is incorrect. I think it was, dude. It wasn't. It was not the millionaire question. It was like a, like a staple name. Household, some are saying. I, I know I, I don't I don't know it. All right, I'm gonna take the regular season goat, Mike McCarthy. Really? Mike McCarthy? That's your goat? Regular season? Is that goat? him above John Harbaugh? Dude, he is a regular season goat. Kind wow. Of. wow, I gotta grow up. I mean, you think about Packers. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess. Was, yeah, fair. There's no real harm in even you know, in losing yeah, in the wild card. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, not not for this. All right. For your job security, there is for sure. Yeah, he's still a bitch, but like outside of that, he wins games. Mike Shanahan? I feel like he kind of fucked it up in yeah, he fell Washington. Off. Yeah. Mike Shanahan did big, not make the list. Big fall-off guy. Bill Parcells. That's who I thought it was. Bill Parcells, I don't believe, made the list. Really? Oh, well, he's a fucking fraud, too. Isn't he supposed to be the GOAT? Is he the one that's like made the West Coast offense? No. Oh. The one who made the West Coast offense? Is the millionaire guy? Yeah. I'm yeah. going to say his name. I don't know. Even though I think on the millionaire, he was a fraud. Who turns it? Tom Landry? Mm. So Tom Landry, you know, I thought that would be yeah. the one guy with the silhouette giving it away. Yeah. That's correct. Fucking gosh. He might be the greatest. All right, what about this other Steve? Bill Cower? Mm, good pull. Bill Cower, that is correct. He's the always. I always get him and the other guy you said yeah. confused. Yeah, which is tough because it's like staple Steelers, staple Ravens. Yeah, yeah. staple these nuts. That's not was Don correct. Shula. He was like the seventies Dolphins. I was like undefeated, or is that Marino? Yeah. How about um? How about like Mike Ditka? Ooh. Mike Ditka. Mike Ditka. Didn't do it like that. God damn. Not ka. I just be throwing out the worst Don't names. Don't ka. What's the score? You have five. So Holy dick! And original I'm at a scoring big wall. would have you winning. Dub. Are we not doing original scoring? Not anymore. No. Fuck <laughs> it's tough for the game, gut for the game. Adam Gase. I'm not fat of you. What do you mean? Oh, uh, that's... The guy in the bottom left's my favorite. Looks like he's not even looking yeah, at them. He looks He don't sick. give a fuck. He looks like and an I don't, FBI I don't informant. Name. Like, I know what the silhouette to the right, Mike McCarthy, I know what he looks like, and I know what team he coached for. No idea what his name is. Dope. Um, You got any names? Uh, I don't think he's on here, but give me Jim Harbaugh. Thoughts? 
I don't even. I'm out here fucking striking out. No. You don't want my thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> the problem with Jim is he coached three seasons. You need 50 wins over yeah. your oh, losses. Oh, facts, dub. Pete Carroll? Just count college. Yo. He feels like he didn't coach Pete enough. Carroll I feel like he didn't just made the wow. list. Wow. Pete. J-Mo tying it up at five. PD baby. Yo. Chill, chill, chill. I need the guy that's not even looking at How us. about, there's just absolutely no fucking chance he's on here. Nothing good. Fucking Bruce Arians. Not Bruce Arians. He I might like have, like, a though. negative winning percentage. It didn't feel crazy. He's with Brady and Carson Palmer. For six. I'm just doing my best. <laughs> just try it. I have an egregious guess. <laughs> Let's hear it. Now's the time. Give me John Fox. No, that that is real egregious. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> Not made sure it, he has it, a winning made percentage. A, made a few Super Bowls. Probably has more losses than wins. Probably. I think it was Bill Walsh was the millionaire uh, guy. Bill Walsh was the millionaire guy. He was the guy who never hit 100 career wins. But also does not uh, <laughs> apply to this list. What a bitch. Who's fatty next to fucking John? Looks that like guy Andy looks, Reed. That guy, I, th- I thought it was at first. I thought that was Mike McCarthy. I to go crazy right Just now. throw out some big name coaches, you know? Yeah, all right. Fucking John Gruden then, brother. Okay. <laughs> you asked for a big name coach. Yeah, but that's like, I delivered. That's like media big, not like actual performance. Big. I'm a he media needs guy. Another job, dude. I swear. Yeah, he needs to yeah, go needs work to at a janitor spot in some high school or Bring something. Bring back John. Gut, do it, gut. That guy at the top looks so much like Joe Paterno. It just, <laughs> it's killing me inside. He didn't coach long enough either. Dougie P, <laughs> put it on the board. Not nah, Dougie P. Sorry about it. For the game, Jmo. How about Dick Vermeil. Dick Vermeil. Sounds good. I don't think it's going to uh, play. Who the fuck is Dick Vermeil? That Vermeule? felt good. <laughs> that f- Dick felt Dick, good. Yeah. <laughs> Dick's Vermeil. Morty, like Morty Schottenheimer. Dick shot. Morty Schottenheimer. That's the correct answer. Morty yeah. Schottenheimer. You in your bag like that? Yeah, I did something. Damn, there. Urban Meyer? <laughs> <laughs> no, not quite. <laughs> College on this team makes it. All right. That's why. Jimmy Johnson? Right. I feel like he got mm. canned. Jimmy Johnson. Not Jimmy Johnson. He's a NASCAR driver? Enough out of you. What do you mean? He's a NASCAR driver. Jimmy Johns? Ugh, I don't know. Uh, Jack Del Rio. No. Oh, I remember. I think if you extended it one more, he was probably the bottom right guy. He's right there with Urban Meyer. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy Johnstein. Nope. I think that yeah, was literally I, just, I, said. just said that. Yeah, Sean Payton? It is Sean Payton. Right, that's Fuck. fucking bullshit. I thought he had. All right. I'll take it. JMO with point number six, win to his name. Thank God. Congratulations. There Who you go. Who the hell is so up top? We have an all time great, one of the most wins as a coach ever with the Bears. Joe Paterno. George Hallis. Jesus fuck. Although he's wearing women's glasses. And then we have with the Brown I think this is with the Browns. Paul Brown. Mm. Uh, okay. Yep. Yeah, top hat behavior. Didn't you do that? Oh, yeah, <laughs> top did. hat behavior, yeah. Yeah, I did that. I we that got, picture, I did, too. Yeah, I did that. We got Curly Lambeau. Who the Ain't fuck? no shot. You threw that black and white guy on the screen. There, what do you mean? That's the only wow. photo. People that like know NFL history are losing their fucking minds Oh, right yeah, now. 100%. Fucking George crazy. Allen, that was one of the harder ones. Bud Grant? That's not who I was thinking of. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck? Um, I, maybe it was Joe Gibbs. I know Joe. That's Gibbs. who I was thinking. Joe of. Gibbs was in a trivia of yours before. Uh, we have cool Steve Owen, another black and white yeah, why guy. Why don't Redskins get rid of the Redskins? We have so not cool. Bill Walsh, but George Steifert, who was the uh, pimp, like, the Steve Young. Yeah, he might be the greatest. <laughs> Your sideways guy. <laughs> What's he name? might be the greatest. And then Wait, Mike Holmgren. That looks like a picture of Andy Reid in the bottom right. It is. Oh, yeah. just wow. like Andy is it Andy Reid? No. You tried Mike to fool Holmgren. us. It's, I swear, <laughs> brother, you tried to finagle us thinking I you wouldn't recognize. I swear, Mike Holmgren. Anyways, Why those is... were all the head coaches in the history of the NFL who have at least fifty more wins than losses in their career. Check us out on YouTube for the full length version. Like, subscribe there. We'll be back for some more. Can't believe Joe Paterno's not on this list. This April, the boys at BDG are going to test our athletic ability with our very own combine. We're going to show off the speed with a forty. We're going to show off the hops with a vertical test. We're gonna be tossing footballs the long way and much, much more. And the very best part is that our favorite sponsors, Underdog Fantasy, will be providing us with lines and you, our beautiful users, can take our hires, our lowers, fade us, parade us, ride with us, die with us. Every athletic testing that we have, you can put your money where our mouths will be being. Download the Underdog app now, deposit using promo code BDG and get yourself a 100% deposit match bonus. That's free money to play with. That's a free 
nice yellow suit brought to you by Underdog. Don't forget promo code BDG. Bring it back today. A little bit of a, a different spin here. We have a wheel labeled 2003 to 2023. Now, the guys are going to fill out a lineup. As soon as a year has been chosen, it will be off the board. Quarterback, two wide receivers, two running backs, a tight end, and a flex. Each of them will get one wheel spin at a time. They pick a player from that specific year and will get those fantasy points as they fill their lineups in. They will be on a very short timer per pick. The points will not pop up as the game is going on. They will be calibrated and announced afterwards. So it's just going to be mayhem from the start, and everything will be figured out later. Gut, you're going to go first. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's spin the wheel. Camera going? That could be a big L. Oh. You've got 2008. You are on the clock. Go. Oh, my gosh. Go. Larry Fitz. Feels like a solid pick there. Can't really go wrong with him within the, uh, you know, so like a that 10 time period. frame. Just, yeah. Who would you throw for 2008? I didn't have anything. Like, two, that's 2008. Probably. So 2008 is off the board. It's just 2008 like is the off the board. Yep. Like you kind of cooked the wheel. there, I think. Yeah, I don't know. I couldn't really think of a receiver. I was maybe going to go Steve Smith. I, don't I know was panicking was and it wasn't even my turn. Like, you 2021, J Mo. Go Jay Jettas. I want to redo my pick. I was nervous. Good. You said you wanted <laughs> said eight, eight seconds. seconds. Yeah. I mean, I had him from the beginning. I just knew there was better wow, options. Bad. All right. We've got two stud wide receivers from different generations. I'm a fraud. Tony. I think that might you be got a wheel spin. No. I'm, yeah, I'm a fraud. 2009. Okay. This, the music is fucking wild. Outside. Sounds like a lot of excuses. Ten. Uh, give me uh, CJ2K. 2009. Uh, very nice. Damn. Boy. There we go. That. Very nice pull. I wasn't even thinking running back. Dude, I can't think of any wide receivers. I, like, in, I was going to go through your range. I can't I run it. Receivers are not coming to my mind yeah, at all. No. Yeah, yeah. Tony, you're on the clock again. All right. Back to back. 2019. 2019. I kind of want to take. And then once once a player's drafted. Can't be drafted. Okay. Multiple, oh. yep. um, to be honest, I think seconds. I'm going to struggle most with tight ends. So I'm just going to lock in Travis Kelsey here. I think that's, wow. a, good, I think that's a good choice. Not going Lamar, I feel like it's crazy. I mean, I, I feel like there's a lot of good quarterbacks. MT. Yeah. I guess it's so. It's so much easier when you're not. Fair. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's It's fair. so much easier. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, you are back on the wheel, J-Mo. Not good. Spin that sheesh. No, got, there's a lot of good. I feel. I just feel confident that I'll be able to get, like, uh, the God other position players. 2013. Sean McCoy. Nice. I think that's a good pull. Yeah. yeah. That's his second biggest year, I think. I, I think it's 13. Is it? I think so. Uh, I know it's one of them. <sighs> you bitch. Gutters. Hey, I'm so chalked. About to get that bike to bike. I know. Ooh. 2017. All right. Uh, 2017. 20 seconds. See, I can remember the running backs who were good. I don't know uh, the receivers. I can't even remember the running backs that were good. Just you're thinking too hard right now. I know. I definitely am. Give me five. I think this is David four, Johnson's year. Three. David Johnson. 16, I don't know. I don't think it is. This feel, yeah, I'm not going to. I don't know. Wait, you said, Who oh, you wait, no, 16? Of? No, it was 17. Oh, it was 17. Yeah, yeah. I'm definitely a year oh. off. Another spin for, no, for I think gut. his bad year is 17. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, oh. I think it is, yeah, too. Yeah. 2004, it's your year. Oh, uh, this one's easy. I'm this on green. so easy. Lock it in. I'm on green. Just saved me. He might be the greatest. Wow, that David Johnson's going to kill the fuck out of me. We're due. We're all due. Oh, man. All right, Jameson, <coughs> this was last two years ago. This year, I'll go fucking Tyreek. Nice. So Tyreek Hill, 2022. Who the hell is 2017? Like, who are you thinking? I'm not going to say oh, yeah. anything. I Could come up. Yeah. Might use it for 16 if I get it. Spinner. Oh, my. I'm Tony. a fraud. It's my turn. Yes, sir. 2007. 2007. That feels so okay. painful. Uh, Randy. Randy oh. 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 <laughs> There we go. I didn't even think of that. That's so good. Tony's just doing a great Tony's job of not overthinking things yeah. right now. Huge spin. We got another one coming Dang. right back at you. 2012. Chives is in his groove. Tony's in his groove. You love to see it all around. I think this was... Ooh. Wait, sorry. I have a running back, a tight end, and a receiver? Yes. Okay. 2012. I'm between two guys. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure this was AP's big year, so give me Adrian Peterson. Adrian Peterson. Damn, Tony is cooking. Yeah, that was AP's so, year, so right? That was, a, that was a 2K year? Or no, yeah, did I miss yeah. that? I don't no, know, so but I just remember you being really confident about the year that he was suspended, so I feel like you probably avoided that. 20? No, you nailed it. Yeah, it's 20. Yeah. Is Tony it? on fire yeah, Tony's right now. like 400 points above us. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go with a uh, little game of action. Come on, Jameson. I'm Stop feeling being good about my draft. Oh, I told me. 05. What do we got? Antonio oh. Gates. 
Bro. No, I fumbled. Bro. <laughs> I, fumbled. I mean, it's. He might yeah, have had no. a good year of the year yeah. after his great year. What? I mean, he can't be used again, so it doesn't matter. And Gates? Gates? Yeah. That was his big year. No. Brother, I made the trivia. There was just there was a dominant player during that time, and I don't think it was Antonio Gates, but you know they might have played for the same team. All right, gut. That wasn't Rogers. his best year though. Yeah, Damn. but you're also like playing defense against somebody yeah. else getting it, you know? Fair, soft pick, <laughs> soft pick. I admit. Damn, getting Rodgers is nice. What year did you get Rodgers? Twenty eleven. Nice. LT. Fuck. 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 See, this is why you needed to take him in 05. Yeah. Gut just canceled out. That's like everything bad. At this point, maybe it was worth playing defense. That's wide receiver. 20, 2010 comes around with Damian Tomlinson, just so no one gets his 06 year. Yeah. Dope. God damn it, Jameson. Give me eight seconds. I'm going to do something stupid if I go further. All right. Ah, fuck. Ooh, whose is this? Damn me. Patrick what? Mahomes. Not, dude, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. Patty Mahomes. Put him off the board. Only option. Well, no, that was his best year, wasn't it? That was his 50. That was most yeah. touchdowns, at least. Ooh, nice. This is me, right? Yeah. This is you. 2023. Okay. Uh, I'll go. I need one more receiver and a quarterback. And right? a flex. And a flex. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll take CeeDee Lamb. Nice, dude. When he's cooking. Yeah, Wait, was JL's trivia right that CD CD Lamb was the number one receiver last year, right? Or was JL lying? Uh, JL did full PPR. This oh, is half. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, that fucked me up. Ooh, this is my year. All right. We need I need a flex and a quarterback. Quarterback. 2014 Empty cows. was the big year of Empty cows. Derek Carr. DeMarco Murray. Okay. God damn. Give me like DeMarco. Direction. Tony is on. Like, I don't know if we Actually, could do anything. I wish I wish I'd chose so someone proud. differently just to play defense, but I'm okay with it. That feels crazy right now. I know I, I like said it, but I don't mean it when I, I said like that before. Eight, right. 2016, J-Mo. I don't know which one is better, but. All right, for my flex, I'll go. God, what's it? I'm going to go Julio. I think it's 15. It is 15. Fuck. What the hell? Got 20, Thank 2003. God. <laughs> 2003. Tony G. Mm-hmm. Tony G. Oh, I only got running back left. Got, you've only got a wide receiver left. 2020. Fuck. Was this his big year? Running backs? I uh, know I have a wide out. Oh, you need a wide out? Yeah. 15 seconds left. Oh, shit. I don't a know couple big wide outs already off the board. I know. Devontae Adams. Nice. 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 I need 2010 so fucking bad, please. You want 2010? Yeah, dude. 2015 was awful. All right. Jamo, Sorry, last spin between 2010 2015. Fuck! No, 15. that's good because then he can't get Cam. Oh, nice. That, that would have been ass. dope. Yeah, that would have oh. saved. 2010. I think this was the year, like, Devontae 15. Freeman was RB1. I'll go with that. 15? Freeman? It was, just yeah. a tough, it was. it was just a tough year. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's why I need a 10. I see what you're saying. Who'd, who'd Tony, well, now I'm taking You're on Aaron the clock, back. 2010. Uh, oh, yeah. 2010. I kind of have a quarterback. Yep. Match I know job. this is Jail Vic, um, so I'm not going to take him. Uh, 10. I, I think I'm just going to play it safe and go Brady. Was that? He goes Tom Brady when Vic was certainly not in jail at this time. No, that he was, was in jail. That was his best year. This was that his was best his year. best year? Yes. I will never <laughs> get his <laughs> fucking jail years right, dude. <laughs> jail, Vic oh, comes back to haunt Tony. So still looks what like he smoked it. Brady tore his ACL. No, we're going to take, a, best year we're gonna take a quick that commercial break cap and come back. He had MVP. He won MVP 2010. That is the biggest cap of your life that that was his biggest year. I don't think it was. Oh, 70 MVP. through 50 times. He won for MVP four times. Okay, well, I'm saying that was one of his best years. He had MVP yeah, that year. That was Amon Green's fucking bad. Why did I pick him? <laughs> I thought it was 0-3. All right, All right so the scores three. are in. J-Mo finishing in second place, surprisingly. For some reason, I thought Gut uh, nah, I picked all Gut the snuck in there. 1,986.4 half PPR points. Gut, 1,820. Tony with a whopping 2,194.7. I mean, you set the tone, I feel like, as soon as you nailed Chris Johnson in 09. Larry Fitz was the wide receiver one in, uh, in 08, so that was a nice little hit off the gate. Yeah, his, his top receiver is 263. That's... I'm on green, felt like a misdirected guess. Yeah. I feel like his big year is 03. Yeah, that was getting hyped up. We you got a lot of the just... thousands, and that would have put me in a fucking – I would have been done. Tony G, I thought he was better. Look, look who drafted tight end one. Y'all said, <laughs> y'all said it was a bad pick. <laughs> y'all said he couldn't do it. <laughs> yeah, Travis Kelsey didn't have any touchdowns in 2019. Yeah. God damn it, Julio. Rogers Look at everyone's flex. Julio was surprising. I, I, uh, you, I, you should have, yeah, that was an A-B. 
all the way. It's, it was always AB over Julio yeah, in fantasy. It was just. David Johnson might as well have just fucking exactly. David Johnson, over. yeah, that's kind of like he the might elephant as well have just, in the room there. Yeah, he had gave had you have hit like the right running back that year. Had you had gone was it Gurley that year? Yeah. Right? If you had yeah. gone Gurley, you probably beat Tony there. If you had well, gut just straight up wins with Gurley there. I think you had three hundred. That's yeah, probably around what Gurley had, yeah. if not more. Yeah, he probably puts you out of your Damn. misery there. Damn. Yeah. Wow, I really was a David John scene away from. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you were cooking, actually. Yo, imagine he had Dude, a thousand receiving yards. Know what it really crazy. is? It's fucking 06 LT. Next, if we do this again, mm. like LT just got if he played that year, just take him. Ladalian. We'll build on this one. <laughs> <laughs> as long as we know who is who over there. Uh, let us know how you like this game in the comments. We could do a bunch of different variations like we've always done with the fantasy drafts. This was probably, once we have all the uh, the T's crossed and the I's dotted, my favorite version that we've done of it so far. Uh, putting the pressure on, quick answers, and uh, kind of awarding the winner afterwards. So Tony takes it down. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you go check us out on YouTube. We're doing full-length exclusive Things like Jeopardy and Wheel of Fortune and games like that. So we'll see you when we see you.